Hey, what's up, everybody? Dr. Jason Jones back with another episode of Health Made Easy. And today, this one is solely for the parents. Um, and we're going to talk about nutritious meals for school lunches. So let's hop into it. So whether you have you know one child or you have more, the truth is, man, those mornings can be tremendously busy from packing lunches, getting ready for work. You know, it's crazy and oftentimes daunting. And another list of things to do in the morning is the last thing anybody needs. But sometimes it's necessary, especially when it comes to the health of our children. Because speaking of necessary things to do, ensuring that your kids you know, take a nutritious meal to school uh, should be uh, among you know, one of the top priorities that we have. The importance of starting your uh, child early on eating healthy cannot be overstated, uh, and neither can uh, it be you know, involving them in those healthy choices. This is because uh, children start forming patterns uh, for their future lifestyle very early, especially in the school environment. And I cannot tell you uh, the number of times I've had my kids' friends come over to the house and they just want more and more and more of the fruit, you know, that we have and more of the nutritious um, things that we have because they're like, well, we just never have this at my house. And I'm wondering, like, what in the world are they eating, you know, at their house if they're not eating that? Or the other end of the spectrum uh, where we have, you know, kids that only eat chicken nuggets and french fries. Um, and again, no uh, disrespect um, uh, or judgment uh, to the parents there. They're doing the best thing that they can do. However, um, I'm just saying when you start early with the children and start expanding their palate early, um, then it becomes uh, much easier later on down the road, and then the kids end up making better choices. So, um, you know, you can, uh, you know, certainly envision yourself preparing nutritious meals for your children, you know, on a busy morning, um, yet uh, with a little bit of motivation, some inspiration, and the right ingredients, you'll be well on your way to safeguarding your child's overall well-being. So to help you out, I got three uh, nutritious meals for you today that you can put in the school lunches. So the first one is a peanut butter and bacon wrap. Yeah, let's face it. Um, peanut butter and jelly sandwiches are the go-to for school lunches. Uh, they're easy to fix. Our children never seem to mind. I certainly did not. I could eat um, peanut butter and jelly sandwiches all day still because they're so delicious. Um, you know, But taking your children by surprise and throw in a new twist by fixing up you know, this particularly uh, wonderful peanut butter and bacon wrap. So all you need is peanut butter, cooked bacon, a little bit of honey. You can either, either, either use a wheat or a gluten-free wrap and a banana. So you're going to put the peanut butter on the, on the wrap, um, chop up the cooked bacon uh, into small pieces, which you could do way ahead of time, and you could cook a bunch of it up at once and just chop it all at once. I'm a big fan of batching those activities and just keeping it in the fridge. Um, you know, and sprinkling it over the peanut butter, you know, uh, which is on the wrap. Uh, make sure you don't use too much bacon, even though that's kind of impossible not to use too much bacon. Um, you know, we, a little a little is just fine. You know, put the honey um, before uh, slicing the banana um, onto the pieces. And then, uh, you know, once the banana is sliced, place the slices on the same wrap. You roll it up. And while you're packing it, you know, add some fruits and vegetables to keep the meal balanced. And, uh, you know, a couple of slices of carrots, tomatoes, cucumbers on the side. We'll add some color to the dish. Really simple, really easy. Second one, hummus and veggies. So regardless of the veggies, children love hummus. Um, I know my daughter does. Uh, it's a combination that you just simply can't turn down. Um, ingredients, all you really need is you need cucumbers, tomatoes, celery sticks, carrots. You need some hummus, um, and you can add a little bit of watermelon in there to have some fruit, a little bit of chicken, maybe some boiled eggs for some protein. Just slice up the cucumber, slice up the celery sticks, carrots before slicing the tomatoes in half. Uh, chop the watermelon into small cubes and place them in different compartments in the lunchbox. Um, you know, pack up all the vegetables together and put the hummus separate. Uh, add some chicken and some boiled eggs, again, to keep it balanced and enjoyable. Number three, chicken salad and Greek yogurt. So this is a perfectly balanced nutritious food um, easy way to make it um, in the morning you can always meal prep the night before which makes it way easier um, you know it's also uh, inexpensive because it allows you to be able to use leftover chicken so you can drizzle G uh, greek yogurt onto the onto let's say a salad um, and it's just kind of like the icing on the cake when it comes to an amazing recipe so what do you need 
about a half a cup of Greek yogurt, one third of a cup of celery sticks, two cups of chicken, uh, a cup of grapes you can put in there, uh, three tablespoons of fresh or dried uh, tarragon, um, three tablespoons, or excuse me, two to three tablespoons of lemon juice. So how do we do this? Uh, we slice the grapes in half before slicing up the celery sticks. And then once you've measured out the rest of the ingredients, mix them all together in a bowl. Notably, the chicken uh, should be uh, skinless and shredded. You can just chop it up into chunks too, which is totally fine. Um, make a few sandwiches and add some vegetables such as cucumbers and lettuce uh, to the lunch uh, lunchbox. Uh, slice a few apples and add some fruit for a balanced diet. Listen, there are a number of healthy school lunches that you can do um, that you can make and, and pack for your children. Um, and all you really need is to keep uh, the meal balanced. Uh, never forgetting to play around with the vegetables and the fruit. Um, asking your children what are, what are the things that they really like the most. How can you incorporate all that stuff together? Uh, presentation does matter when it comes to having an appealing meal, you know, putting them in little compartments or mixing them all together, depending on your kids' wants, needs, and desires. Uh, and then just keep it fun. And more often than not, almost every one of these that we described, I mean, you can make them the night before. Um, and then when you get up in the morning, all you got to do is throw them in the lunchbox and they're good to go. So hope you enjoy these recipes. Uh, you can certainly go to our blog um, and check it out. And we have all, all of that's on there, all in detail. Um, so this is Dr. Jason Jones signing out. And if you like this, you know, hit me up on Facebook, hit me up on Instagram, send me a DM if you want to, and uh, just let me know that you appreciate it uh, because that helps me know what is working and is helping you um, achieve your best life and help you guys uh, keep moving better and performing better and living better. So uh, thank you again, and we'll see you on the next podcast. Bye-bye.